Amazon drop shipping from Walmart. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at drop shipping from Amazon onto Walmart. So without wasting any more of your time, let's just jump into the video. So the first thing that I want you guys to do is when you're drop shipping items from Amazon over onto Walmart, what you first have to do is you have to find out the products that you want to use so let's go over to amazon and look for products now we are looking for products that aren't really you know popular like for example an iphone like almost everyone knows how much an iphone goes for but no one really knows how much does a outside table goes for a cooker goes for or stuff like that so we are talking about items like that that people don't really know about so first things first let's go ahead and look at a couple of different items so let's go over here on search and search for outside table or something like that so let's go ahead and search for outside table over here as you can see these are the products that show up so what we can do now is we can look at these products and then select that product and then search for the same product over onto walmart now what I wanted to do was search for outside table and chairs. So let me just go ahead and fix that. So, okay, now we're done. So over here, as you can see, these are the product that we are looking for. So let's go ahead and select one of these products. So let's go ahead and select this one over here. Now over here, this is the product. As you can see, it's pretty cool. It's really, really nice. Now what we need to do now is we need to copy this, you know, name. Let me just copy this name over here. Okay. Let me just copy this name and then we are going over onto Walmart. And then what we're going to do is we're simply going to search for this product. So let me go ahead and click on enter. Now, as you can see over here, this is really cool. The items that we are getting right now, these are like the items. These items are going over for $619.599. Now, what that basically suggests is that these are basically other drop shippers all right and they're selling this product for really really you know expensive we can't really do that because that's really weird because the the product itself is you know because the product itself is like 50 dollars or something like that but like you know you get the general idea like you have to find a product that is really really good but that isn't really expensive as well like somewhere around 200 dollar range or 300 dollar range i mean you can sell more than that but you have to make sure that the price that you are putting is not you know over the top is not too extravagant or stuff anything like that so over here as you can see um down below like this product is also going over for like 5.99 like 600 dollars and this this one over here is also going over for 5.99 so 600 dollars so i think that both of these ads were posted by the same you know dropshipper or person so that so that makes sense why the prices would be similar but like you get the general idea like over here like if someone is selling this product for like 402 dollars and over here someone is selling the same product for like 300 dollars that would be really really good because that way if you're going to sell the product you are going to sell it and make quite a lot of profit as well like for example your drop shipping item from amazon over onto walmart right so what you basically need to do is when people come over here onto amazon what you they want to do is they want to find a product and you're already shipping the same product from walmart so you have to find the cheaper product so like if someone finds a table for six hundred dollars what you need to do is you need to find the same table for less amount of money and it can be even any amount like it doesn't really have to be a lot less like it can even be like five or ten dollars less than the amount that they are already paying or stuff like that like if if this table is like fifty dollars right like this table is fifty dollars then over here on walmart what you need to do is you need to find the same product for less the amount so maybe like 40 dollars so this makes me you know bring ourselves into the second part of this video which is called selling it so basically i'm going to be telling you how you are selling the product so once you have you know selected the item that you want the price looks good and everything and the dimensions and colors and all of the details match up what you need to do is when a person you know buys this item from amazon right they are going to give you all of the detail options like delivery and payment details and stuff like that 
what you're going to do is you're going to copy all of that delivery options and stuff like that and over here on amazon you're going to find the same product but for cheaper so when you click on it when you buy the same product you enter in all the details of that person and then you click on ok and then you will click on send so then what that happens is that after a couple of days like three or four days uh the person the person that ordered from amazon walmart will you know uh send this product to them in three or four days in the order instead so that is how it basically works now what you need to be careful of is that you need to you know be sure that that the product that you are sending from walmart is from a legitimate seller because usually what would happen is that you know someone would you know buy an item from amazon and like you know in a three or four days he he's waiting but the item still hasn't reached so like he waits for like two or three weeks but the product hasn't reached yet so he contacts amazon and he's like you know hey amazon where's my product it's been two weeks then amazon is like you know they'll send that product to them but since we are you know dealing with a third party we are drop shipping the item we have to make sure that the delay doesn't occur because then you, you'll be like you know over here on walmart and you'll be asking the person and they are going to not respond to you and they're basically going to make you look bad and drop your ratings and you can't really you know recover from that so you have to make sure that you are buying your products from a reasonable and from a reliable seller so that no delays occur and that the buyer can trust you and buy your product so these are some of the details that we have to look out for when we are drop shipping items from different websites onto different platforms as well so like over here as you can see like this is the same product right this is the same product as that one right like it's brown 41 by 41 by 28.9 like let me just check out this one over here where is the dimensions about this one so over here as you can see 28.5 inches in height 28.5 inches in height so the details match quite a lot so i think that this is the same product and it is going over for 5.99 and this one is also going over for 5.99 but we also have to consider in the 15 percent fee that amazon usually charges its sellers so we have to keep that in mind so basically we'll have to be paying more money over here instead of less money than we usually would so we have to keep that in mind that is why i'm telling you that we have to find a product that is much much cheaper so that we can you know easily take advantage of drop shipping so find a good product but for a lower price onto different websites as well now you can use the same method onto other websites as well like you can use the same method to drop ship from ebay as well or on aliexpress or any other website you want like it's really easily i just showed you walmart because it's not that popular and it's not that easy to do sometimes and people don't know that if you can actually do it and i'm just over here explaining to you that it is possible like it's really really easy so once you have added that all you have to do is just wait for the person to add in all of the details such as the delivery address and the payment details for you to add over onto walmart and then you can ship them as well that so that is how you basically you know drop ship from amazon from walmart and i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did be sure to hit the like button subscribe to our channel and turn on post notification and having said that i will catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye